it, everybody. You know who it is. So, basically, we just did a bunch of robberies. And, uh, we made a considerable amount of cash. You know, like a decent amount of cash. And, now, we don't know what to do with it. Well, I guess I know what to do with it. In the grand scheme of things, I'd like to buy some properties, right? But, the unfortunate thing is... I just don't have enough money to get a property, but what I could do with this money, as opposed to getting a million dollar property, which I can't afford, is I could just go to the Los Santos Customs and give this little primo here a little bit of an upgrade, or at least see what we can do, because I've leveled up a little bit since we've last pimped out the primo, and I think that this time around we might be able to actually get some nice... Uh, effective upgrades. Who is this? Who is this? Don't hang up. This is okay, I won't. Yeah, I'm kind of a big deal, and uh, you can be too with my own patented bull short testosterone. Oh, okay. Okay. I. You know what? I've heard enough. I've heard enough. Oh, it actually does something. Boost your damage and toughness. Interesting. So yeah, we're taking a nice early morning drive down to the customs. Give our car a little bit of a, a little bit of a makeover. Is that the word? Is that is makeover a word? Why does it sound like it's not a word? Interesting. Uh, where is the customs, by the way? There's got to be one close to here. I think there's one down here, somewhere. I mean, I'm looking at the map. Um, bruh. Okay, I guess there's one over here. Go there. Cause the reason that we we gonna gonna want to get an upgrade on our car, you know, there's a lot of reasons really. One, it might make the car look cooler. You know, I mean, not saying this car isn't beautiful, but could certainly use a couple upgrades that are more practical you know maybe an engine upgrade maybe an armor upgrade just something to give this car a little more uh, strength a little more durability on the road um, something that'll help us do our missions a little faster get through some of the tedious parts of uh, of our missions you know instead of driving around in this car I mean this car has done wonders it's fast but always do better you know what miracle did you want me to perform? I would like a miracle on my car the primo it looks like we can get an armor upgrade no brakes you can add a bumper a custom front bumper gonna have to keep track of our uh, of our money here we can get a little bit of an engine upgrade rank 90 for the last upgrade rank 100 so basically by rank 100 I should have all the upgrades I need but it's gonna take a while to get there but there is some cool little cosmetic stuff we can do here I like that sports grill interesting Hmm. Can't get xenon lights yet. <sighs> I keep forgetting. How do I change my license plate? I got that one app on my phone, but it doesn't seem to work. Ooh, can get custom skirts. Ooh. Oh yeah. I I see it now. We're gonna get all this stuff. Lowered suspension. Turbo. Darken the wheel. Uh, the windows a little bit. All right. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do some some work here. All right, that's for sure. So we can do an armor upgrade. 
right here, which is not bad. Um, so we'll do that, make our car a little bit more durable. And we can also do some bumper work. Get an extra front, extra rear, and we can even upgrade our engine. And get some chrome tip exhaust. Damn, look at this thing. And we can have the custom skirts on the side. Ooh, hell yeah. This thing looking nice. And then we get the, the high spoiler. Yeah. <laughs> you can lower the suspension a bit, you know, a little bit lower. Get a little window tint. Yeah. See, and it's not even that expensive, really. Alright. So one thing I wanted to do is give this thing a nice little color finish. I wasn't sure how I wanted to do it. There's a lot of color options. Most of them are uh, locked, unfortunately. Like lime green. I wonder. How do I do lime green? 25 stunt jumps? Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, that's going to be a lot of work. I don't even know how to do stunt jumps, I'm going to be honest. A lot of these colors are quite ugly. Reds though. I think we could upgrade to a, a nice bright red. Formula red. That is a lot of money for a paint job. But you know what? I think it's I think it's worth it to be honest. I think it's worth it. Sick. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it looks so good. Okay, and now wheels. So there's a lot of different wheels to look at here. Um, these are all really expensive. I'd rather get the cheaper wheels. I wonder which wheels are cheapest. Okay, these ones are cheaper. These ones are not bad. Okay, these ones are okay as well. I kinda like these. I think these look pretty cool. Let's get them. Yeah. For a color. Oh. <laughs> the red rims. That looks pretty sick. Yeah, I think we'll get that. Alright, look at this. Look at this beast. Look at this beast. Oh my lord. This thing, this thing hits. Oh, there's a train. <laughs> there's a train there. And someone's actually waiting at the bus stop. Hey, uh, I see you ain't been on that laptop in the clubhouse yet. Yeah, yeah. Tell it to the judge, buddy. All right. We're driving around in this thing. Ain't nothing gonna touch us. Now that we got a new ride. Man, we can do a lot with this thing. You know what I think we should do? To celebrate? Oops. Um, it's fine. You can't even tell I hit anything from the back. Don't worry about it. You know what 
I think we should do to celebrate is we should head down over to a, a nice little convenience store and give it a little Robbie Rob. You know what I'm saying? Nice little robbery thingy thingy. But also, look at this top speed. Damn. This thing hauls now. It hauls. I wonder how fast we're going right now. Can I check the speedometer? Over a hundred? One hundred ten? Just about a hundred ten, that's that's pretty fast. I wanna see how fast we get zero to sixty. Okay, like six six seconds. That's pretty respectable. Six seconds to get from zero to sixty. That's not bad at all. I mean, there's some sports cars that can get a third of that, but this is pretty good. Damn. I mean, it's got a little bit of damage right now, but usually it would be looking pretty, pretty good right now. Well, we're going to have to rob this store, which means we're going to have to change into our notorious robber outfit. We're going to get these witnesses out of the way. So you're going to want to run away. You're going to want to run away. Yeah, this, guy's, this guy's not going to know what hit him. Yes, we're open. You're terrifying. Just give me a second. Move, yeah, yeah. I am moving as fast as I can. Yeah, yeah. Tell it to the judge, buddy. I bet this guy's gonna pull a gun. I'm calling it right now. This guy's gonna pull a gun on us. I hope you sleep well tonight. Or not. Maybe I was wrong. Alright. We have successfully made away with the cash. And this cop's gonna see us. This cop. Okay, there's literally a police station right there. Hey, but see, the good thing about being in a robbery here and then getting your wanted level outside of the car is that once you get inside of the car, they're not going to know who it is, you know? They're going to be pretty oblivious to, um, to who's in each car. So they're going to have to get right up next to you to actually know who even is in the car. They're not going to see you when you're in your car. You're kind of safe. You're safe in your own little home. Easy. Easy. Another thing I wanted to do quick before we started anything major was, um, okay, let me change my outfit. We got to shave this stash, all right? Because I'm not going to be taken seriously. Got it. Oh, this is the fancy one. This is the fancy, fancy uh, hair stylist place. Hopefully they don't charge too much. Oh, it might actually be free. No, it costs money. 500 bucks to uh, shave my mustache. Oh, is it worth it? Is it even worth it? if it's worth it or not. <sighs> yeah, you know what? It's worth it. Looking good. I love making people feel this amazing. Alright. Now we're ready to tussle. See you around. We're ready to destroy the competition. Let's go. Get in our wonderfully red Albany Primo. And we're off. So I wonder, taking this thing through the car wash, will that actually fix our vehicle? Or will it just clean it but not actually repair it? Well, we're going to find out.
Um, oh. Can I help you? Hello? Hello? It said press E to use car wash. I'm pressing E. I don't understand. What do they want from me? There we go. Oh yeah. Straight through the vehicle. Oh my lord. I don't think I've ever done this in GTA before, I'm gonna be honest. Okay, it didn't fix anything, unfortunately. Our car is just clean, but still destroyed. Oh well. Let's go, Ooh, look at that, look at that shine. Oops! Um, I'm sorry. I wasn't really checking my depth perception there. So, I think that, um, since we've got a nice kitted out vehicle now, we should, uh, commemorate the occasion by taking a little joy ride through the city. Or just, I guess, around the island. We'll listen to some music and really have a great time and just hope to the YouTube gods that I don't get copyright striked. Oh man, I'm really messing up the front of this car. Why are you on the wrong side of the road? Oh no, I'm on the, I'm, um, I don't know how this happened to be honest. following traffic laws. I wonder if I'll get striked. I guess, I don't know. I can always mute this part of the video. Kinda hard to drive like that, I'm gonna be honest. Oops. Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you, that guy was completely invisible on my screen. Vehicle's holding up pretty well. The armor definitely makes it uh, easier to continue going. You know, the speed isn't decreased significantly due to the damage or anything. Don't say anything. I don't know. Okay, Lester.
Ooh, it's uh, it's one of the freaking, it's one of the action figure things. Look at this. Isn't this just great? Yeah, so cool. I actually, I literally leveled up because of that. <laughs> That's a good way to get RP. Hustler. Looks like we've uh, acquired a mission from Martin. So there's probably somewhere on the map that we can go to check that out and see what's going on. Oh, gang attacks. Ah, uh, yeah, we, we can do gang attacks. Those are fun. I did those a lot because I had nothing better to do. They're actually pretty dangerous as well. that for you. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I'm just looking at the view. Tony. Yeah, I get it, Tony. I get it. Yeah, you know, sometimes... You just gotta go around and uh, take time to really appreciate, you know, the different uh, places around the map, you know, the different sites to see, the landmarks, the locations. I mean, what is that? That's like a scrapyard right there. That's pretty cool. There's a wind farm, some power cables. What is that? A dish, dish grid thing? There's a radio tower up there. There's the the Bolingbroke Penitentiary. There's the sun. There's Mount Chiliad. You know, there's so many cool little places to check out. One day we'll one day we'll visit all of them. I know this. It's gonna be great.
I see the city. that beautiful city. Sometimes you just gotta stop talking and just listen to the music and, you know, just take it all in. Beautiful world that they created here. Beautiful. My favorite song. totaled my car. That would not be good. They skipped the end of it. That's about par for the course, though, for, uh, for radio stations. Man, look at this sunset, though. Wow. Look at this. My God, that is truly something special. Whew. Me and you, Primo, we're in this together, all right? Me and you, we're in this together, all right? and you against the world and we're gonna win you know that we're gonna fight the world and we're gonna win nobody's gonna stop us now 